Hey everybody, welcome to the recap for season three. It's been a pretty fun season for sure. We had, just to kind of go over some things, we had two series. We talked about power and we talked about industrial networks and they were some wonderful episodes that we shared. Got a lot of good feedback there. To recap a couple of ideas that we had, we had our first OEM on here. We had Chung Chi Tai from Blueprint Automation, and he had a, shared a wonderful inside look at, at what's going on there, how things are changing and evolving in the OEM space. We also had our first system integrator, and we had Bobby Cole from Think PLC. Had a fun time talking with Bobby and getting to know him and, and seeing how that system integrator business is, is evolving in the future. Then we talked to Nepal Ciota, and he told us about how do you keep your team engaged. And that can be very difficult, particularly right now within the pandemic. And he had some really good tactical ways that, that helped a lot of people. And then we also had a really good inside look at life cycle services. And that was brought to us by Lisa Scanlon from Rockwell Automation. And that really opened my eyes to some things to consider in the future as industry continues to move. Then we had some, I would call them, let's see, innovators in industry. They were some pretty cool topics. And we talked about machine as a service with Mike Cromachy. That was fun. A brand new concept that we learned about. We talked to Ray Zignato about, hey, manufacturers, it's okay to ask for help and knowing when to go for that help and why it's important. We got to talk to Dan Carnavali, who is... The, the genius at Eaton at the, the Power System Experience Center, he basically built the place, and he really walked us through how he takes videos and tries to break content down and topics down for people that want to learn about industry and what's working. He shared some funny stories about his daughter and, and shooting the, the, a water gun to, to explain how voltage and current works. So fun stuff there. And we also met Tim Wilburn, who is a leader in, in automation. He has a wonderful following on YouTube. He's cranking out videos every week on automation topics. And he was sharing with us some stories, some wonderful ways that he's found to connect others to industry. Then, you know, we know you love our hero conversations, and we love them too. We had 13 hero conversations in, in season three. And uh, four of them were brand new guests. So the, the new people that you got to hear from were, was our former president and CEO of ECO, Mr. Jack Lawson. That was wonderful. I always remember some things Jack said about his daughters and how she, they always felt like he was always there. Uh, that impacted me greatly. We met with uh, a young up-and-coming engineer, Mr. Brett Melanson, who is just doing some wonderful things at Bueller and got to, got to meet and know him and learn about how he, he transitioned from Louisiana all the way up to the great state of North Carolina. We got to talk to Dr. Travis Hodge at Vulcan Materials, and he really shared about how his faith and his, and his career are one and the same and how they, can, they really have, have helped him make wonderful decisions. Uh, he shared some great insight there as well as his, uh, his Sugar Bowl winning uh, moment he had at Virginia Tech. Then I got to talk to my buddy, Mike Tricario at Certainty. They're one of the largest shingle manufacturers in the world. And he got to give us a real good inside look at what goes on inside that plant and things that he's working on uh, as they continue to uh, evolve into the future. And then we had nine other wonderful heroes that had already been on Eco Ask Why and shared just really good ideas with us. And so we asked them back. We said, hey, your, your, your ideas were so good. People wanted to hear about your stories. They, uh, they all graciously agreed, and we were able to share their hero conversations with you as well. So what's coming up for Eco Ask Why in the future? What's new? Well, we're on YouTube. Hallelujah. We're there. It's been a lot of work. We've been trying to get ready, and now we are there. So every one of our our podcast will be on YouTube now. So I'd love it if you subscribe, leave some comments for us. We're also on Instagram and you can, you can find us at eco ask why. And we're putting a lot of posts out there around really quotes from our heroes because we find that it just impacts us so much. So, you know, check us out on YouTube as well as Instagram. We're starting to increase our releases. And if you're a subscriber, I'm sure you're seeing that. So I hope you're enjoying that. And you'll, you'll see that continued focus around serving industry. You know, and bottom line, I want to know what you think. 
we have a really cool crew here that are, that are working hard to give you the, good, the, the best information possible. So let us know what you think. We're always looking for those ideas and the heroes that we like to share with others. So please bring those to us. And i also like to ask one, one more thing. Let me know what questions you'd like me to start asking in these hero conversations. You know, what else would you like for me to peel back and start and start seeing what, what our guests would share with us? So any questions that you'd like to see me start asking, love to. St- I'm still learning as, as a host. Please give us that feedback. I'd love to take it. Finally, just want to say a big thank you. Thank you for taking the time to listen. Podcasts, are, they can be 20 minutes to you know, close to an hour. So you're investing time. Anytime you listen to Eco Ask Why, it means a lot. We really put a lot of effort into trying to bring, bring you information that's going to help you in your career and in your life. So just thank you so much for taking the time to listen. I do hope you subscribe. Check us out and all the, all the links you'll find in the notes here. And, I, and again, we look forward to more great conversations in the future as we continue to support this, this growing industry, this innovative industry that's out there, and it's continually to evolve. So it's exciting. Thank you again. I hope everyone has a blessed day. Thank you for listening to Eco Ask Why. This show is supported ad-free by Electrical Equipment Company. Eco is redefining the expectations of an electrical distributor by placing people and ideas before products. Please subscribe and share with your colleagues and friends. Also, leave comments, feedback, and any new topics that you would like to hear. To learn more or to share your insights, visit ecosy.com. That's E-E-C-O-A-S-K-S-W-H-Y.com. 